Hey, it's Anna. I'm here. Welcome back. This is my Monday evening jewelry sale. And today, predominantly, I have uh, uh, vintage costume jewelry. So um, I'll get started in just a little bit. Wait for some people to come in. I see Linda was here. Hi, Linda. And it's marvelous Monday. <laughs> um. Anyways, as you're coming in, um, if anybody new comes in, just make sure if you want to speak in a chat, make sure you're subscribed or we won't see your message. I hope you guys can hear me. Can you hear me, Linda? I see you're the only person here. More people should come. It's a regular day. I'll wait for a while. It's just eight o'clock now. I know a lot of people come in fashionably late and I like to come in fashionably early. Um, I don't know. I don't like being late. But. Mainly, hi, Doris. I already said hi to Linda. Yeah, they'll be here. I did pre-sell some stuff. I do have a, a little bit of sterling, not much. I mainly only shopped at the estate guy with the estate guy, and I picked out uh, a lot of costume. But um, And I did, like, verify the sterling uh, that I do have. And I did research uh, as much as I could. Um you know, it's good enough. Uh, I'll be, I mean, I can tell you what it is, the pricing. Um, I usually, I always try to stay lower. <clears throat> Prices are over the place on uh, on the internet, though. I hear someone running up the steps. I must feel like you guys can hear that. But anyways, this is my Monday evening jewelry sale. Um, I will um, do auction with everything, I think. I might change my mind on that. You never know. But anyways, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. And if you would like to purchase and have never bought from me, um, email me here at VintageJewelryGalore at Yahoo.com. Okay, I just need to know your YouTube name, the country in which you live, um, and your PayPal email address. If you don't use PayPal, um, you know, some people don't, I can have the invoice sent to your email, and then you will get... Uh, you pay as a guest from there. But if anybody has any questions, ask me. Um, I'm going to get started like right around, uh, I don't know, five after or so. <clears throat> so I got I got sick again. I feel like I've been on a nonstop roller coaster or something. <laughs> it's terrible. <clears throat> I, I was exhausted. Sometimes when you're overly tired, you get um, you can get sick. So. Well, I can't hold her right now. I could still look at her, but I'm not holding her. I have um, I have some nasal congestion, and I had chills last night. Like, I was, like, freezing. I had to get up and move um, into the living room and lay there. I was freezing, then it was hot. Yeah. it. I think it was from the over-exhaustion. I mean, it, it was a lot. I lived at the hospital for non-stop till my daughter got out. But anyways, enough of that. I do have jewelry, mainly costume, like I said. Um, I have a lot of stuff, like, laying around here, but I'll probably just concentrate on what I just got. They did sell a small portion of it. Probably, like, I don't know, maybe a tenth or something. I don't know. Hi. Hi, Kathy. Yeah, I'm fine, though. I'm fine. It is what it is. I pushed myself. You know how that is. I felt like I had no other choice. Honestly, I couldn't leave her there by herself. Anyways, mothers don't do that to their children. At least <laughs> if they need me, I'm there. All right. So I'm going to get started in just a minute. And don't hesitate to ask me any questions. Um, I do have a uh, the, ne the Art Deco um, one necklace is nice. I believe it's Art Deco check glass. But yeah. I need to get out shopping a little bit more. I do like the vintage costume, but I limit it myself to one location instead of like six. So, but it's okay. I have the peacock. Patrick, you here? I don't know if he's here. I know there's a couple of people at one of the peacock. Um, well, a number of people. Last week, but I pre-sold some things. It is what it is. All right. <clears throat> Yeah. <clears throat> All right. I see so quiet. I wish I could hear you guys talking. <laughs> but anyways, I'll get started in just a minute. If there's anything you're looking for in particular, ask me. Okay. Um, 
All right. I do some nice costume jewelry, actually. It's all costume, though, for the most part. Two pairs of silver earrings. One for, like, made in Italy with diamond cut. And a pair of hoops. Oh, and a little pair of um, rose gold vermeil. But this thing, um, all right. I'll wait just a couple of minutes, but um, where is it? Here it is. It's nice. I think it's nice. Um, it says braid on here. It's only five after. Should I wait? I have been. I cleaned it. This looks really nice. I'm going to wait till 10 after to start. Okay, then I'll get started. That's what I usually do just to give. <clears throat> Hi, Patrick. People who, you know, were waiting to see something or something. Give me a thumbs up. I'm not, I don't always ask for that, but go ahead and give me one. Why not? Maybe we'll do something with the uh, data on <laughs> here. <clears throat> That's really the only way I promote my channel. I don't really go to anybody else's channel because they don't have the time. I'm lucky you have time to get a bath. No, I'm joking. Um, <laughs> I'm going to get started though in a couple minutes. Hi, Wendy. But um, it's burning organically. Usually, like, more than half of my people buy off me that are in my chat. Hi, Alina. Um, and, you know, so it's just fine with me. But, all right, I'll wait just a couple minutes. If my voice sounds a little funny or anything, I have been sick. Again, um, I, I worked myself to exhaustion. Not really worked. I didn't rest. Anyways, um, it's hard. All right, I don't know, my... Right. The um, I think the two best dog uh, things that I have is the check glass necklace and that uh, the peacock. The peacock's pretty amazing. Now, I, I have quick a quick thought on date looks 1940 to me, and I think I'm right on that. Just um, I do the, the way it's designed, but it's an amazing uh, perch. It's humongous. And it looks like diamonds. You see what I mean? How it does look like diamonds. It's pretty. Could be a little bit before, actually. Here. It is like you have these. These are all soldered on, like holding on each section. It's pretty well made. It's cool. Is my lighting okay, guys? Because I'm on a different table, so I could be camera down. I didn't want to go up looking like I don't feel real well because I don't. <laughs> but I didn't want to go on like that. So is, is my I think my lighting is okay. I'm just a little close. I think I get overly close with it. All right. What is the time? Is it? It's 8.08. It's time to get started. We'll start the peacock. All right. Okay, thank you. Let me put it back. I like being uh, camera down sometimes. This this starts at 50. Okay, thank you. I appreciate it. But these stones are all like paste set in there and um he has a a red eye. And there are the clear all over the tail here as well. And this is all glass and rhinestones. I tested a couple of times the rhinestones um because it looks like they could be something better but i i do think they're rhinestone but that's the back i see patrick and thank you i thought he was cool he's huge this is like a five inch brooch i see alina 51 thank you it is five inches yeah i love peacocks i like birds Patrick's at 53. Thank you. And they kind of look like flowers when you turn it sideways to me, but it's definitely a peacock. 53 is the hybrid. It is open back on the uh, glass. Okay. See if Alina, are you going to come back in? Let me. Just let me know if you're out. Let us let me know. Um, I couldn't find one. Do you know who it is? You want to share that with me after you can email me 
if you don't want to put it in the chat. Um, <laughs> it's well made. I don't see a name. I did look. Um, oh wait, maybe I do see a name. Give me a minute, okay? Fifty-seven with Patrick. Thank you. There may be a name up under here. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't see a name. I can't here. I can't turn it. I can't make it any bigger. I don't see one on it, but there should be. It's five inches. I think it's beautiful. Lena's at 60. Thank you. It's cool. <clears throat> the, the peacocks at the um, aviary are a little, they're bad. No, they're not. There's one named Pete that has like a big tail. This may be that type of bird. I think it's pretty. Or it's oh, 65 with Patrick. Thank you. I couldn't find one. Okay. And I know it's good quality because it's heavy weighted and you can tell how the stone's put in. And it's just made differently than what they make more modern jewelry. But I can't, I couldn't find one like this online. I did look, I did research some. <clears throat> I had somebody tell me that they wish I would research my, I, my, things, research my stuff before I came on. I was like, okay, you might know what it is. 68 with Alina, maybe you could research. I, even though, well, never mind, I'll get into that. Everybody should research her own stuff. Okay. 68 with Alina. Because people like might price too high for something, might price too low, and that's good for you. It happens a lot, believe it or not. <clears throat> but um, he's cool. Patrick is out. All right, so um, Alina gets it for, yeah, yeah, that's true. Maybe it was annoying her. I don't know. Okay, um, Patrick is out, so sold for 68 to Alina in five, four, three, two, one. So thank you. Thank you for your bids, Patrick. I think it's cool. I'm, I almost wrote your name down. Hmm. He's cute. It's a big birch. I picked that one out of the counter. Some of the stuff I dug through the box for, I mean, it's some of it's a really nice costume that you don't see just anywhere. Oh, um, okay. Now what should I do? How about this necklace? Um, This is signed, check, made in Czechoslovakia on the ring right here okay and i think it's nice look i'm gonna have it on the the white both you have caps i feel like i'm too close or something you guys could see that right it looks dim to me and they're graduated in size and then you have the centerpiece i did wash it um just with a little bit of dish liquid Mainly the stone. I didn't like scrub the metal or anything. Um, because it needed it. It looks a lot cleaner. So it's short. Let me measure it. Some people I know want certain lengths and you want to know. All right, it's 15 inches. So it is short. It's a good length actually for that. For the style of it, I think. It looks beautiful. It may even be older than that. I don't know though for certain. I'll show you the details. I did do a little. And you used experience. It is starting to be experience on some of it, mainly costume. Hi, um, hi Ashley. But, um, but like something like this, I did have to look it up. And I couldn't find anything quite like it. I didn't think it was Niger Brothers. Am I pronouncing that right? Probably not. But, um, because... I don't know who it is, but it's beautiful. It's short, 15 inches. And I did pricing. I'll start this at 75. I think that's a fair price. It's pretty. It's doubled here. Kind of like festoon, not really though. But it's a short necklace. Um, it's beautiful. All the details on it are very beautiful. The caps. 
you have the um like the carving or etching on these pieces here and let me see how it looks i swear my eyes i it looks blurry to me it might just be my eyes but are those kind of like florida leaves how are you doing ashley okay cute I said cute to dangles. All right, it's a beautiful necklace, and I'm happy with that amount. Um, I'm gonna call it five, four, three, two, one. Sold to Kathy for seventy-five. I oddly got a really good deal on that. <clears throat> I think it's delivered though. I think he he tries. I spend I spend a decent amount of money actually. All right, I'm not gonna say it's Art Deco. I think that's what it is. It's definitely antique. You're welcome. It's very beautiful actually. Okay, put it in with this stuff on there. And I do have all your stuff. I'm going to work on it Wednesday um, or Thursday morning. Wednesday, just to make sure I get it out. It's It's been insane. Maybe tomorrow. All right, thank you and congrats. All right, I do. I saw a couple of things. Do I have any MMA collectors? I have a grip, a grip wall. Grip wall. And this is, um, it's glass. And it's French. Thursday. Okay. Thank you. Um, yeah, it's been, it's been bad. I did. I mean, yours, I, you know, I have to take my time with it and stuff. And I did take my time with everybody's. It takes me a long time to wrap my packages to make sure they're safe. Um, I mean, you have to like put enough uh, tissue paper in and padding and surprise takes time. Why can't I, there it is guys. All right. Thank you, Kathy. This is, um, it's beautiful. It's glass. This is Monet, 1980s, 1990s. It's spelled uh, the necklace type is um, G-R-I-P, or series, I guess you could say. G-R-I-P-O-I-X, and it's um, pronounced Gripoa, kind of like Gripa. Okay. Fold over clasp. It's beautiful. I've had a couple of sets of this. I've had three, two sets and then one random necklace that I sold online just like this, actually. Sold it on eBay. But I'll open it. It's a fold over class. The gold looks great on it. It's very nice. It's one of their higher end series, unfortunately. Um, a line, their higher end line. I only have one piece. Okay. Too bad I don't have more. <laughs> it's pretty. Those are glass cabochons. They French. It's glass. They call it poured glass, actually. I don't know if it truly is in the form though. Okay, it's Simone back there. I'll give a measurement. It's 17 inches. And um, all right. It's nice. It's actually very nice, Monet. It's in the book, obviously, too. 80s or 90s, I did not look it up. Um, they they go for a good price. This I'll start at 50 if anybody's... Um, no, uh, now I did. It's beautiful, though, look. It's very nice. If I find the earrings, I will let you know, personally, if I find a pair. I'm going to go back to a store, a store and dig through stuff. They might be in a box. All right, Kat, um, Alina's in at 50, thank you. I thought it was beautiful. I'll just wait a minute in case somebody else is thinking about it. What, 17 inches, kind of like a collar necklace, a um, little bit lower than collar though. Well, collar boom, I guess. It looks good. Nothing's faded on it. It's 17 inches. Let me make sure of that. <clears throat> I'm tired. I kept waking up with chills. Ugh. Okay, let me make sure. Second guessing myself, I've measured more than one. Um, 16 and three quarters, actually. Okay, it goes down two. So, yeah. It's beautiful. Yeah, I sold the one online. Oh, oh, look at how much I sold it for a bit more than that. All right, I'm going to call it 54321 sold to Alina for 24. I got a, um, I got a good deal on it as well. Thank you. Oh, that's your... I got a 
put this uh, away from the bird. All right, thank you. Um, I have a cool pair of earrings. Look at these guys. Um, I didn't test the metal. Terrible. Okay. Um, but anyways, <laughs> these are goldstone with Miller Fury, like mixed in it. There's goldstone bead hair. It's it's just a weird um makeup of a pair of earrings, kind of. It's goldstone with Miller Fury glass in the center of it. You see that? Am I too close? Okay, let me move back. So goldstone and just blue glass. I thought they were cool. I don't know. They um Ten, starting bit of ten dollars. If anybody's interested, they are all glass or it's goldstone with Miller Fury. I don't know how they did that. Okay, I'd like to know how. Goldstone hair and goldstone Miller Fury hair. I think they could have probably made this in a different pattern or something to utilize the stones more. Hi, Patty. But I thought they were cool. All right, I'll leave them here for a minute. No, no, you don't. I can send the, um, hi, Rachel. Thank you for being here. Um, I can send the PayPal, um, invoice out to your email address and you can pay as a guest. All right. No interest in these. That was long enough. Yeah. You, you can pay with, um, as a guest from there. <clears throat> I feel a congested. So I hope I don't sound worse. Um, <clears throat> should have had some tea. Okay. I I have this thing, this thing, this thing. Okay. I have pearls. I have a story for them though, okay? <laughs> um, these are nice. You're welcome, thank you. That's 14 karat gold. But the rest of it, I don't get a reading on it. Now if I don't sell it for what I at least got it for, I'll just take it back. I was told I can do that. But that's 14K. It's marked as such on here. And it's a pretty decent sized clasp. I don't know how much it weighs. They're doing good, Patty. Thank you. They're doing good. They're relaxing now. Um, she's been getting up. The baby sleeps well. But anyways, this metal down here, I, I, I scratched it. I don't get a reading at 14K, definitely. Um, I don't know if the, somebody put a clasp on it. I'm just, I'd, let me be completely honest about it. You know what I mean? Change it up. This is gold. And these are really beautiful coin pearls. And let me give you a measurement. I will in a minute. It's nice. I mean, the clasp is worth, I don't know, at least 50 or 60. The pearls are quite beautiful. 16 inches for the pearls um, on the first strand. But coin pearls. Hold on, I feel like it's twisted. Here, give me a minute. I don't know. See, um, I saw it up there and I brought it home and thought maybe it was verme or something, and, and but I'm not able to really scratch that right. So I'll offer them for what I paid for it. If they don't go, I'll just take them back. They are very beautiful, but like I said, I do believe that this is this is 14k, definitely. Okay down to where it connects and it's a decent sized clasp it's pretty nice but i don't know what the rest of the metal is okay i'm not getting a consistent reading i can't scratch this piece i just can't it's too thin i'm not gonna scratch it all over and break it i'll just get okay but it's a nice necklace i'm gonna offer it for what i paid for it. if nobody wants it then i'll take it back hi susie i think it, they're really beautiful um they're really beautiful pearls Coin pearls, they have a nice luster on them. Okay, so um, I'll start at 58 if anybody wants it at that. I mean, you do have the gold clasp. I don't know how much it weighs, but this is a box clasp. And there you go. See, like so. It's nice, still beautiful pearls, you know. If you um, don't mind not knowing what that is, maybe you can figure it out. I don't, I'm not convinced. Definitely not 14K. 
Hi, Jeannie. I know that. I, oh, I see Kathy in at 58. Thank you. But the pearls are quite lovely, and you definitely have a decent size um, clasp back there. I don't know how much it weighs, though, either. You know, it's probably at least, it has to be at least two grams, I would think, gram and a half. But all right, we'll see if anybody else comes in. They are natural. I'm going to say freshwater culture um, queen pearls with a 14 class. I'm going to call it to Kathy. Uh, 54321. So, Kathy, thank you. They're very beautiful, actually. Thank you. Congrats. It's, the, the clasp is probably worth that. So that's good. If, all right. And they're real and beautiful. All right. Thank you. Thanks, Kathy. All right. I have a bunch of um, white. I have some silver earrings, a couple pairs, a bunch of clear rhinestone earrings. Um, one pair that's pretty amazing. I still didn't find out who they are, but it's okay. I don't need to know. <laughs> Not really. I mean, oh, wait. Patent 1967. That's the patent on the click. I don't know. It might just be the, uh, the click brand that I've seen around, actually. That may not, you know what I mean? It may just be the clip that goes on the earrings, but that's not saying who the maker is because a number of companies could have used the same. You can't look the patent number up, though, but I didn't. They're nice. I think they're nice. All right. They're clear, right? So, um, let me see. Make sure you're in live chat. Okay. There's that. They dang, they're dangly. You have an emerald cut one up here, then round and combination of different cuts down on this part. I think they're pretty. They are starting bit of, um, of 25. If anybody's interested, the clips, let me show you the clips. They have a patent underneath. Is it riveted on? It is um, riveted onto there. And they're nice. They're nice earrings. And I see Patty and Alina. Thank you. Alina's at 27. This one's a diamond there. Let me hang them back up, actually. Yeah, we're <laughs> we're we're co sleeping. Not with the baby. Baby is a best man. <clears throat> okay. All right, thirty one with Patty. Thank you. Rhinestone, clear rhinestone earrings. These are fully pruned. I don't know how old they are. Really, mid century. We could say that thirty five with Alina. They're long. They're they're about two inches. Let me see how long they are. Actually, thirty six with Patty. They are two and three quarters, the tip, like the very bottom, it goes. So they're almost three inches. They're silver tone, and they have that clasp. It has flowers on it, etched on it, the clasp. I don't see a name on it. Hold on, I'm looking again. No, look, it's just flowers. Do you guys see that? All right, so 36 with um, Kathy. I'm Patty, I'm sorry. Elena, are you still in or are you out? Clear rhinestones. I'm wait. Sorry. Let me check the clips on my ears, actually. That's thinner than an ear, but just to make sure they're good. I don't know. They're a little loose. I'm going to have to tighten them, okay? So, um, unless you want to tighten them. I feel like they are. I think one of them might be a little loose. None of these are diamonds. I didn't get any diamonds this time. <laughs> you know, he's pretty good at picking through his stuff. Um, I think one of these might be a little loose. This one's a little bit loose, guys. Um, it needs tightened. I could tighten it um, and offer them again when they're effective, okay? So, I'm just going to pull them. When I get them... Uh, tightened if they're able to be tightened and worn i will uh offer them again i'm sorry really sorry um i was moving fast 
Okay. I have, um, they're pretty. I have a number of pairs. I have uh, some screw back ones. These are beautiful too. Yeah, I'm sorry about that. They're not hard to tighten. I just want to make sure I do it without destroying the earring <laughs> before I offer it. You know what I mean? And then what do I do? Come back and say, I broke the earring. No, 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 no. I don't. No diamonds. Nope. I didn't find any. I do occasionally. Not, not lately. I haven't gone back to my other location. But look, these are pretty. Screwbacks, vintage. You have round and square. These are like an inch and a half. These ones will start at, um, they're screwbacks. These are older. Let me show you what they look like. They, that's the back. All right. All right. These, um, I'll start these at 15. They are silver tone and clear rhinestones, fully pronged. They're not as fantastic as the other ones, huh? Yeah, yeah. Not all the time, though. One and three quarters. Um, I do, though. All right. I think they're pretty. Anyways, uh, Kathy's in at 15. They're screwbacks. All right, I'm going to call them to Kathy uh, in 54321, sold to Kathy. Thank you. I think, I think they're nice. What else do I have here? I have these climber ones. These are nice. These quilts are definitely good. I know because, thank you, Kathy. Congrats. These are right and the left, I think. All right. Um. Clear rhinestones, these are pretty big clips. I don't see a marking on them, but that's about. And they're multiple shapes. I think they're cool. There are multiple shapes. There's marquee, round, uh, rectangle, and emerald, I think. And this clip's good. I just rolled it off. I didn't have it connected. I'll show you. I think I'm tired. <laughs> oh, there, see. I had them up above and it just fell off the side. Okay, so these are, did I say how big they were? They're two inches. Yeah, I haven't been there. Some of, I think the stones look pretty good. And you move them, you see just like some, um, okay some color very like variation or some of them dark hold on eh, maybe a little bit on this one might be i don't know if it's my eyes or not they, they're pretty though anyways if anybody likes them um they're they're pretty big i'll start them at 20. i think they look good oh i need to make sure they're actually hooked on but Ear climber, kind of. I think I said it, they were two inches. They go on like that. So that's how they would actually be on your ear. And they're pronged. All right, there's those. I'm going to leave them laying there. Yeah, I am. It's it's just crazy. How tired you get. Um. All right, we'll pass on that on those. What? Okay. Let's see. Um, no, oh, wow. Your message came through late. Um, when the, the one, I think. All right. Um, let me see. I did pre sell a portion. I do have some, I will be going out more this week. I, I have to, <laughs> I have a really long gym rehearsal. 
Oh my god, what was that? Wow. Okay. Hold on, guys. It's a little disorganized. I knocked all my rings over. It's okay. Um, <laughs> they're fine back there. Okay, this is a really long Joan Rivers here. And it's really insanely long. I'm going to button it and like fold it into four kind of and measure it. I think it's like 72 inches or something. This is exceptionally long. And it's signed um, Czech Republic. Okay. 11, 22. 22 times 4 is 88, right? Yeah, that's really long, like somewhere around that. And it's signed Czech Republic up on the, um, the opposite side here. It says... It says Joan Rivers on one side, you know, her normal. And then on the, no, no, I have all costume here for the most part. Um, I don't have any, uh, any costume ones. Sorry. I'll keep my eye out. All right. I'm sorry. My throat. <clears> throat> Okay, so this is Joan Rivers um, signed Czech Republic, really long. This is like an opalite glass there. Okay, I'm going to start this at um, at 35. It's 88 inches by measuring. It's on chain, and it's from Czech Republic. That's where it was made. Very long. It has a, um, a lobster claw clasp. Mixed in there. It's it's really long in uh class. <laughs> Hi. Hi Lisa. That's opalite class. There's some wood on here too. Like the well this one feels like wood. That's opalite. I don't think it's an agate. It says Czech Republic. I would think glass, wouldn't you? But um so it's a mixture of different colors of Glass that look like gemstones, kind of. All right, all right. Um, I see Lisa, and I'm. I'll just call it. I don't have to take too long. Ah, uh, five, four, three, two, one. Sold to Lisa. Thank you, Lisa. Um, I saw this uh, priced all over the place on on the internet, like insane. Some people. I don't know how some people. Um, <clears throat> where they get their price at? Okay, so thirty five. Um. I called it. Didn't I call it before Lori came in? I'm sorry. Did I, guys? I think I did. Hi, Lori. I should be watching closer. I, I did not. Um, okay. I'm sorry, Lori. Um, I, yeah, that's 35 to Lisa for the Journalist Czech Republic. I'm sorry. It's a cool necklace, I thought. Um, that's super long. She has like different types. There's a God, I can't even put a stand back here. This is cute. Look, it's cute. <laughs> I think it is. Uh these I don't know, kind of look emerald cut or rectangle. Look how pretty it is. Um, I don't see these a whole lot. Um, this color, at least I don't. Because I shopped in the stores. Okay. So uh, these are all fully pronged. And pink rhinestones kind of look like a pink sapphire. But it has a pretty J-hook too. It's adorned. It's fully pronged. All right. It's 15 inches from um, end to end. Wait, I think I, all right, I have to turn it the right way. Okay. There we go. I think it's pretty. The stones look really great on it. Look, it shines beautifully. This is a starting bit of um, 28, if anybody's interested. It's it's really pretty. Fully pronged. Um. I don't know if those are emerald cut, what, what you would call that. 
They look like rectangles. They're nice. Patty's at um 28. Cheryl. Okay, Patty came in first. Hi, um, hi, Cheryl. So you could go up any increment as long as it's not cents. But they're all the way to the end. It's pretty. 30 was Cheryl. Thank you. When I get Google lens to just to get an idea of price, um, uh, pink sapphires came up. <clears throat> it looks very nice. It's definitely class. I tested it and looked at it. <laughs> okay, 32 with Cheryl. Thank you. I do have a little agate. What else do I have? I have a milk glass, a tassel -y thing here, a tassel -y thing. Lots of costume. I'm going to try to get to as many places, 36th for Cheryl, as I can. I have to ease into it. I still have to help Mari, like, make sure she eats and stuff because she's still in pain. Plus, we don't leave her in attendant. We don't want to walk her up the steps and down. Uh, 38 with Patty because they're steep. So, And Cheryl's at 40. Thank you. Yes. It is a beautiful um, J-hook that's adorned with um, with two pink rhinestones. Forty two is Cheryl. It's pretty. Like I said, don't come into this color a whole lot. Hold on, let me there we go. Forty six with you're welcome and hi. Hi, Crystal. It's pretty. Forty seven with Patty. Vintage. Pretty one mid century. Let's do the milk glass. I sold the one milk glass that looked dark deco ish. This is a J Hook one. It's nice. It's mid century. I have that still. It's like a collar. 49 um, with Patty. It's pretty. Yeah, it's it's really pretty. It's a nice one. Nice uh, necklace. 50 with Cheryl. Thank you, ladies. I'm sorry if I'm bumping my table. I have a, um, I'm using a table that I had like supplies to fix things with. I just wanted to be up against the wall. I see Patty at 51, thank you. And and, you're, and uh, Cheryl's out. It's very beautiful. I'm gonna call it down. Uh, five, four, three, two, one, and sold to Patty for 51. Thank you, you're welcome. Cheryl, thank you. It is very pretty. A crystal. Okay, thank you, thank you. All right, let me find a bag for me. Yes, congrats, thank you. Okay. I have, I think this is cute. I don't know who the maker is. Again, it doesn't have any mic or mark on it, so I wouldn't want to take a guess on it anyways, really. But, look. Well, I will take a guess on it. I thought it looked like Godet. How's that one for you? Yeah, it's very beautiful. It'll look nice. Okay. Um. I I was saying it kind of looks like it could be Godet just by what's going on with it. That or Whiting a Davis, although I don't see a marking on it, okay? It's gold tone, and you have two angels on it, a big piece of opal, opalite opaline glass in the center. It looks like it's probably foiled back there. Um, and then you have the molded beads, and these are the true, well, like more, um, you see the glow even more in these because... It's nice. It, it's gold tone. It's costume. Molded opalite or opaline. A spring ring clasp back here. It's a vintage necklace. Um, I don't really know how old. 80s, probably something like that. It's vintage enough, right? Um, 28 inches around the neck and a total drop of 17. So you have three inches on the clasp. I think it's pretty cool. I mean, not on the clasp, on the pendant. It's a long necklace. And let me lower it. I like it. You could take this off and put it on a shorter. Um, I don't see any marking on it. That's what it looks like in the back. You could take this off and put it on a shorter necklace. Look, it's pretty. If you want it. Or you could double it up and wear it doubled up like that. All right. Opaline 
I don't know who it is, but I'll start it at 30. I think it's a nice necklace. Um, it's gold tone. It looks pretty good. It's not fa all faded up or anything. I think it's nice. Um, I don't know who the maker is, like I said, though. It does have these little cha channel parts in here. You have that and then uh, triple chain gold tone. You have these pieces. And this is wired on there. And it also looks like it's not just wired on there. There is a hole in the center connecting it, but they wired around it to decorate it, I guess. All right, so that starts at 30 if anybody's interested. We'll leave it there for just a second. My water. <clears throat> I'm going to have to get up and get more. All right. What else do I have? I do have, these are Kramer, I think, New York. Yeah, Kramer patent pending on the clip. That's what these are. All right, we'll pass on that. I thought it was pretty. Okay. Um, these are the Kramer. These are clips. Flip. I don't think so. It's just a um, like a support or something back there. Looks like something may have been hanging off of it, actually, now that you look. Or you can hang something off of it. Do you see those two hooks? I'm, I'm moving way too fast. Okay. That's just, it doesn't flip. That's how it's hooked on. Oddly, it's soldered onto there. That's a nice piece of um, opalite. Or opalite. All right, these are Kramer, New York. Not Kramer, New York. I'm making it up. These are Kramer. <laughs> I thought it said Kramer New York and it actually says Kramer and then patent because it's a patent on these. They are um, clear. Clips are good. They are clear rhinestones. You have a, uh, these, hold on a minute. <clears throat> Trying not to cough and stuff in your ear, guys. I can't enlarge, but they say Kramer and then patent pending under there for the clip. These are a silver tone clip. And they're small. Um, they're not real big earrings. They're probably about two inches. These parts are fully pronged, and then you have rhinestones pronged in these beads. Yeah, I, there may have been something hooked onto it, actually, originally, too. I don't know, you know. I couldn't find it. I saw similar from a Whiting and Davis in uh, two inches on these. In um, the other brand, what, who is it? Gordet. Their stuff kind of looks the same sometimes, but I don't know who it is. Could be completely something completely different. Clear right stones, Kramer. I will start these at 18. Silver tone clips and sign Kramer back there with the patent or number. I don't know. I feel like I'm too close. All right. I'll leave them. Wow, that's kind of far away. I have a lot of clear rhinestones. Um, I don't know why I bought so many. I think I carried away. <clears throat> I couldn't look any longer. There's so much to look through. I had to stop. I had to get home. All right. I guess I'm, I'm going to pass on the Kramer. These would be like mid-century sometime. Clear rhinestones. They look pretty good. All right, I'll pass them. I think it was long enough, right? Okay. Um, is there anything anybody was waiting to see, or did I sell all of it? I did pre-sell some things. Oh, these goodie combs are cool. How about this? This is beautiful. I have jewelry behind me. Um, this is really nice. Everything's fully pronged. Yeah, I got a lot of Claire today, that day, though, and it's, it's vintage. That is the hook back there. It's a simple hook. Um, I don't know if it's original or not. Kind of looks like it wouldn't be, but that is the hook. Maybe it is. I could be wrong. But there are, um, these are like a citrine color going all the way down. Okay, I'll offer those two. Give me one minute. Let me give you a measurement on this, and I'll give you a price. It is a... 16 inch necklace so it's short and then you have a th I think a three or four inch drop on a tassel it's 
three inches on that piece, the center piece. It's beautiful. Looks like a Joseph of Hollywood piece. In that. <clears throat> I don't know who it is or how old it is, even as I believe mid-century. It's got a good weight to it. It's not a real thin one, um, like real lightweight or anything like that. It's pretty. That's three inches. Okay, if anybody's interested, it's a starting bit of 35. I think it's pretty. You'll probably find the earrings there at some point. But you have like these double right there, double row of rhinestones in its single up here. All the way up, it goes all the way up the back. And they're fully pearled. These ones are, um, it looks like a bridge look. Those ones are triangle rectangles. This is the clasp. It's a simple looking clasp. Not sure if it's uh, original or not to it, but it is just a that. There's no marking on it, and it's it's small. Here's the back. Let me show you the back. It's soldered on. You can see. And all of these are fully pronged. You have darker brown down here. And these are like a citrine root bear combination here. All right. Let's leave that there. Let me see. It's, um, I'm sure to go to I'll leave that there for Cheryl's and thank you. It's pretty. I'll, I'll go back and see if I can find the earrings. Um, all right, I'm going to call it 54321, sold to Cheryl for 35. Thank you. I'll show the goodie comes um, in one second. Thank you. Congrats, Cheryl. It's pretty. Okay. I'm going to call it Amber Citrine Rhinestones. Okay. Let me find your tag. Well, you didn't you get something else, or did you get? Yeah, you did. Oh wait, this is that's perfect. maybe not. It's rolling and it's happy. So. All right, this is your first thing you were bidding. That's why I thought you had enough something else. You're welcome. Thank you. It's beautiful. I think I don't know if it's um the original clasp on there or not. Um, okay. Um, yeah, I have them. I have goodie combs. Um, I think they're, I have these ones. There's two of them. I think they're really nice. They're signed goodie USA. I think that's what they say. I'll show it to you. Let me see if it's right. Well, just goodie on this one in USA and goodie. Are we? They both say USA and goodie. So these were made in the USA. That makes them rare, doesn't it? No, um, they're vintage. I'm not really sure exactly how old they are, okay? I could have done more research, but I, I didn't. Sorry, I didn't have the time. Um, but you guys, I'll, I'll start them at a good price, and if you like them, you can get them. Um, I did do, like, comps. I did do that. But I, you don't always say, well, maybe I didn't. Here, these two I will start at. They're nice. These are nice for holding, pulling your hair up, like, and they actually work. And it's hard to find these, like, nice ones like this. Those rhinestones are nice. They're kind of put in, like, paste. They're not prong, but they look, they look nice. 70s, do you think? Uh, I don't know exact date. Anyways, but, um, I'll start them at 18. That's for both, of course, because you need both of them. These are great for, like, if you pull your hair up and then put these down the hair to hold it. Patty's at 18. Thank you. So, guys, I'm going to go. I'm going to get a more natural color in my hair and try to blend it in with the gray so I can go gray. Hi. Hi, Erin. I'm just going to call you by your, that name, okay? Hi. They're nice, though. I have a bigger one too. So I, I see Patty and we'll see if she, if anybody else is interested. Alina's at 20. See, they are booted on there. They're, they're well made. 31 with 
You meant 21, Patty. Okay. That's what I thought. There's no need to go off that high. <laughs> Not yet, huh? Um, they are like uh, riveted on there. They are actually not riveted. What would you call that? They actually have screws holding them on there. 21 with Patty. Um, I'm going to have to go get water. Let me see what I can do. <laughs> what, what I can do. This i got to go get some water. Um, if I don't keep drinking, I'll end up, uh, yeah, if I don't crack it, you know how it is. All right. I'm going to do this, okay? Um, we're at 21. Patty, you're going to see if Alina wants to stay in or not. I'm going to go fill my water, guys, real quick, okay? High bits 21 with uh, Patty in here. I'll go. I must go get some water. I'll be right back. I like drink all of that. I'm sorry. <clears throat> I had to get a drink. I'm too thirsty. I thought I was just going to knock the entire train on the ground. Okay. Glad I didn't. Okay, so you're out, Alina. The rhinestone area is metal. They're actually metal. This is metal. And you see how they are riveted on there. So they are metal there. And they're beautiful actually. The way the rhinestones are set. You you you're out then, Patty. So twenty dollars to Alina. Okay. Do you want them for I'll give them to you for twenty. Are you out then, Patty? Um, <clears throat> I think it's what you meant, right? They're nice. Probably a loose sighty type thing. Okay. So 20, Elena, do you want them? They are metal. That makes them a little bit better than the plastic. Better quality. All right. Sold to Elena for 20. Thank you, Patty. Uh, five, four, three, two, one, and sold to Elena for 20. I have a nice fancy one. It, it may be plastic, that one. Let me see. Uh, 20 for the goodie. Okay, let me find you guys. Okay. Oh, you got that fantastic people. That's something I just keep to look at, like hanging over on my curtain. Um, I have this one too. Is it metal? It is. It's signed uh, Goody in USA as well. It's fancy. This one's fancy. It's only one though, but signed USA and Goody, and this one's clear. Um, I don't know, some kind of plastic. It is metal rhinestones, clear rhinestones. They look pretty good on there, and these are like booted onto there somehow. Let me see exactly how it's being done. It's being held in place by by metal on each end and then in the middle but it's nice this one i will start this is um this is a nice one i think at 12 it's only one but it's very beautiful it's big i like the shape and that's clear goody usa and i see patty in at 12 thank you i do have um i have this too this is a kirk's folly hairpin you guys might have seen me drop it out of my head i have two barrettes all right, I have beautiful bobby pins, too. All right, I'm going to call it to Patty. I think it was long enough, right? <laughs> yeah, made in the USA. That's a lot. doesn't have much. I have another pair of, of virgin earrings from 1940s. They look cool, filled. They're not marked as such. They have a patent on them in the USA. All right, I'll call it to Patty in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So to Patty for 12. It's really nice. I, I, I was tempted to keep them, but I decided I didn't need them that bad. 
they end up getting lost. But look at that, the shape on it. I like that. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. There we go. I found your bag. Thank you. Um, is any, anybody interested in any of either of these? Um, this one looks this one is has a little discoloration on the stones. It's signed made in France though, and it, it's older. Um those are clear rhinestones. There is some dark going on in here. But it's uh signed made in France. I think it's nice nonetheless. It's older. My, I'm really, I'm moving around funny. Do you guys see that? Is my computer okay on your end? I have a lot of buffering. Oh. My internet's on. I paid my bill. <laughs> and now am I? Okay, I think it's okay now. All right, this is made in France. This is older. I don't, I don't know exactly how old. Anyways, um, I think it's back to normal now. Sorry about that. It was. I, I saw that. This, um, I'm starting bidding everything, even small um, end items. Here, this is what I'd like for it. If not, I'll wear it. Starting bid of 15. It's pretty. Um, these are all fully pronged. There is a little darkness. This is an older, an older pin. I didn't test it or anything. I think it's just silver tone, signed made in France under there. Let me see what else it says. I was in a hurry. Made in France. It has a D over in the corner. It must be maybe the person on the the uh, clip. The uh on the, the clip itself, okay. But all right, nobody wants that for 15. I'll wear it if not. I don't mind the dark stones. It looks like it'll hold my hair good. Anyways, I'm going to move away from the purplish hair. I think I'm going to get a normal color on my head. All right. We're going to pass on this one because it's beaten up. I'll get the bobby pins. Let me pass on that. That's, I'll keep it. I like it. I'll wear it. I think it's nice. Um, Don't expect to sell everything. It's not really reality. Um, to me, it's not. Anyways, uh, you saw another day. These are really beautiful. These look like crystal. Hey, let me see if they say anything. Okay, the bobby pins. Wait, is there some writing under there? Look, they're very pretty. No, I don't think so. And I do think they're just silver tone. I didn't test them or anything. They're not, they're, they're nice. Look. Yeah, I still have those. I'll show those next. These are older vintage bobby pins. Um... 60s or, or more recent though they're not pronged they have the prongs but they're not pronged um they're nice though and i i like the the stone it looks like crystals probably a foil back could be a rhinestone you know it looks more like shiny um when they do the foil foil back but they're nice these bobby pins are starting bit of 15 if anybody's interested i think they're nice i will do the lagunas next i have a multicolor. I have Laguna multicolor, and then I have a pair that have no name on them that are really well made that um, don't have a name on them. Though. Okay, I see Patty, and these are nice. These are great when you're pulling your hair up, and they're nice. It's much nicer than having a bob messy bobby pin, you know what I mean? The tips look, they're probably Bakelite. No, I don't know what that is on there. Um, it has a, they're vintage. Probably 70s, 60s, or 70s. All right, I'm going to call them out. I waste too much time. If somebody else wanted, they jump in. It's not like a questionable thing or anything, I don't think. All right, 54321 sold to Patty. Ah, they're nice. Congrats. It was fun going to a store. I spent like two hours looking through boxes. Um, They're nice. I like them too. They're nice. I, they're just, uh, they do have bobby pins that have rhinestones in it, modern, but they don't look like that. You know what I mean? They're beautiful. Okay, congrats. Okay. Here's the two pairs of earrings. I didn't wash the lagoon. I did wipe them up a little bit. Um, the clips are good on these. 
I, I could wash them too because, I mean, they're not filthy, but they, they don't have any rhinestones. They are, um, these look AB more than vitriol, so just different colors with AB. And they are signed Laguna back there, clips about two inches. Everything's wired on, and then they put a cover on. Um, these are probably like, uh, these are definitely like late 50s um, or 60s or more recent. Okay, I don't know exact dating on them, but I do know that because they have an AB coating on it, and they didn't start using it till later on, so I can make roll that out in my head okay um these are one they're on one and three quarter inches sign like you in the back or clips they look great they're nice um what did i say i was going to start them it doesn't matter um they're laguna i think they're nice 20. they are all wired on here black faceted glass there are um there's pinks reds and um, like a grayish with like an AB coating over it. Do you see that? I think they're nice. And they are Laguna brand. Thank you. Alina's in at 20. Your mom would wear these? 60s probably, huh? Late 50s or 60s. They're nice. They do go, like you have a left and a right on these. So one will go, you know, on each chair and they will climb up it a little bit. All right, I'm gonna call them to Alina in five, four, three, two, one. Sold to Alina for 20. Thank you. Laguna clips. Yeah. Multicolored. Okay, let me find your bag. There you are in the front. All right, I have I already showed those ones. What else? Did is there anything else, guys? Oh, I have these ones. These are nice. I'll show them. These are A B. I'm going to call them glass. I mean, there. I don't think they're crystal. Um, I, I don't know. could be wrong, but they have a lot of AB on them. It's hard to tell, you know what I mean? Um, usually, like, you'll see one part won't have it oh, when they are. Anyways, this is wrapped. Everything is wrapped on here, see wired. And these are nice. They're about an inch, though. You're welcome. They're not quite as long. I think they're an inch and a half. They are clear AB glass clips. I don't know, mid-century somewhere. I'm not, I'm a little more recent than mid-century, actually. All right. And they're one and a quarter inch. There's the back. Silver time. They're riveted back here. Look. Oh, I didn't even put a price in, did I? Um, 15. They look good. The, the um, glass looks great, or the crystal, whatever you want to call it. Kind of looks crystal -y. Um, oh, I wanted to show you. They're riveted in the back. And um, everything is wired onto there. All right. I think they're nice. Yeah. That's, um, my mom wasn't much into jewelry. I mainly wear rings myself. I will wear necklaces. I'm not big on earrings. I don't like the way they fail. Um, okay, Lena's in at 15. Thank you. They're nice. I have a pair of rose gold for me. Look at, I think these are nice. Look. All right, I'm going to call them. Uh, I could just do buy it now on a lot of this. Five, four, three, two, one, sold to Lena. I might just do that. Well, I don't want to do it. Somebody might want to go up a dollar, likes it or something. We can just keep it as is. A, B, glass clips. <laughs> um, these are nice. Let's see what they're signed. They are 95 and rose gold for me. These are lever backs. That's a um, cubic zirconia. It's pretty. Here, they're pierced steering elite um, lever back. I'll show you. I think they're nice. They are sterling silver, and they have a rose gold finish on them. They're rose gold, gold for me. Yeah. I like how big they are. These are about a one-inch earring um, total drop. The uh, 
CZ. Yeah, three quarters. The CZ is a little over. Um, oh, it's a little over a half inch. Okay, sterling silver, rose gold for me. I'll say it for the third time. Some people want to know. Um, if anybody's interested in them, I think they're a nice pair of earrings. I'll start them at 15. They are sterling silver, sign 925. And they have this big CZ in it. And I think they're really pretty, actually. These were one I was going to keep, but I was looking around today and I was like, haven't worn them, sell them. But okay, I see Penny in it 15. I try not to build it up. There, we'll put them in the box. All right, I'm going to call them. That was long enough, I think. Five, four, three, two, one. Sold to Patty for 15. I do have two more pairs of sterling, and that's about my dad up for sterling besides those two rings that I've shown before. But um, I'm getting hot now before I was cold. Thank you, Patty. They're very cold for me. Um, CZs. Thank you. Congrats. I think they're really pretty, actually. They do say something else on them. PAJ925. And they have a patent number on the on the earring. Okay, thank you. Let me find you. There you go. Okay, um, let me put your thing in there. I have this. I thought this was nice. Um you have a combination. There's no maker's mark on it. It clips up like that. It'll fit a lot of hair in there, decent amount. And it's clear and purple. And the pattern. Is I don't know if it's deli it's deliberate that it's like that. It could be. It's it's different on each one. They are fully pronged, I think, or partially. Let's see. They're fully pronged. This is brass. I think it's a nice barrette. It's pretty big, like three inches. <clears throat> it's vintage. I'm not really sure exact age of it, honestly. I don't know. If anybody wants it, it's a starting bid of 10 for that. You have a favoritism with one of them? Oh. Okay. I see what you're saying. I wasn't reading all of it. All right. Rhinestone for it. I think it's pretty purple and clear rhinestones throughout. And I'm kind of close. Wish I had somebody to pluck my chin hairs. I get chin hairs. I love all of them. I, I love all my grandchildren. Izzy so cute. Did you see the picture? I, I'm not allowed to post pictures of her. Okay, guys, I slept and did that. Okay, shh. I had to. It was just such a cute picture, the way she was laying on my shoulder. And oh my God, and her eyes were bulgy and open, and she was resting herself on her arms and She's just a tiny little baby. All right. <laughs> so I'll pass on it. Why am I showing that so well? Maybe. <laughs> there you go. Um, I don't I think this is nice. This is one I was gonna keep for me, and I decided not to. This is a big, large flower power one that's nice as uh metal enamel, green, and black. The black rose, black dahlia. Yeah, I had to share it. I mean, what was I gonna do? It's so hard to you not to share them. Come on. I mean, what? That's just weird. Four inches. I don't know. Here, this is, if anybody wants it, I'm going to put a starting bid. 30. It is a black metal enamel rose. Um, it's well made. It, everything is bracketed together in the center, as you can see, and it's soldered. And the clasp is operational. It's a rollover clasp. And this is metal as well as the black. I think it's nice. Yeah, she's something else. And these right these are rhinestones in the center there. I like that. <clears throat> if anyone's interested. It's a beautiful birch. If not, we'll move on. I think um are they prompt set? Um partially. Um hold on a minute. I want to let me show you underneath this crystal. They have the 
prongs, but they're, are they pushed down? Hold on, I'm trying to, I'm looking and I'll show them to you. No, the prongs are there. This is 60s. I mean, it's a flower power 1960s birch. Yeah, it went fast. Oh, she's so cute. But no, they are not pronged. They do have the prongs, but they're not pushed down. Okay. I believe it's a 1960s flower power birch. I like it. It's nice. It's big. And I thought it was pretty fabulous. It is. You have one, two, a couple layers and then the center, too. All right, I'm gonna pass on it. I like it. Um, I, I actually, I have worn it a couple of times. I think it's nice. Let me see what else I have. I have um, a milk glass necklace, it's an agate necklace. And how, how long have I been on? Um, it's nice, I really like it. I'll wear it. Look at how, this is a, look at that, listen. This is a Harlequin um, jester, signed Taiwan in the back. Signed Taiwan. It's signed back here. It's cool. Let me see the price I'd sign on it. Um, twenty-four. I think it's cool. Those look. Those are crystals. Those look like crystals in here. He's blue, green, and and red, and a faux pearl head, enamel hat, enamel shoes, enamel stockings. He's a jester. Some places had him listed as like a clown. I think he, well, I don't even know if he's a jester. I don't look at him. What? Oh, she, the baby's just fantastic. And she was really alert in a picture I had to share. I bonded with her and now I'm sick. I can't touch her. All right. I see Alina 24. It's cool. It's cool. I didn't see any available, um, but I did place it under what I saw they sold for. It's pretty cool. Signed Taiwan. It's vintage Taiwan piece. And I do think those are crystals and they're faux pearls. All right, I'm going to call it to Alina for 24543321. So I thought it was cool. I don't know what to call him. This, um, he's cool, though. It's just a Harlequin. Uh, Chester, I'll call him that. Okay, thank you. All right, I have Nolan Miller. I have sterling silver hoops. Thank you, Alina. They're not real heavy. They are open in the center, but they are sterling. I don't, these are hoops, as you can see. I don't have the backing to them. But they're like an inch and a half. I did test them. I could weigh them if you want. Yeah, I don't like it. But I, I can lay by her. Her head just has to be up the other end in her nose's bed um, when she's taking a break. All right, these are <laughs> not eating or sleeping. She sleeps in a bass and a side bassinet that goes beside the bed. But wait, I didn't. I sold the jester. I'm sorry, Patrick. I sold it. I sold it for $24. Orlina. These earrings are sterling hoops. And I will start these at $18. They're nice. They're nice size. They're an inch and a half. I don't have the original backing. But they're an inch and a half this way. And I put a little rubbery backing on it. I can see if I have one that fits it. I When I was looking, Patrick's at $18. Thank you. They're nice, though. I got these a while ago out there. Sometimes I will find in his boxes, like, things... He's got a lot of jewelry out there. I wish, um, actually, I don't wish I had all of that because it must drive him nuts. Well, he makes a lot of money. All right, I'm going to call him the Patrick. 54321 sold the Patrick for 18. Hopefully, I'm not moving too fast. Yeah, I have a, um, I have a crystal as well. My oldest is crystal. Thank you, Patrick. Her name's Crystal Murray. I have Eva Marie, Crystal Marie, Marietta, Elizabeth. Okay, we'll talk about one and eight. You're welcome. I have a milk glass necklace. It has that simple hook on it. Um, it's milk glass. It is pronged. 
it is it's a j hook it is um 15 inches so it's short these are fully pronged you have marquee and round like square okay and they go all the way up the back it's a short necklace the other one was this one's nice the other one was older and nicer but i did sew it hi amy that's okay all right so for the real class i'll start it at um I, I let me see i did look it up how are you doing amy um i did look it up i don't think i really worried about a price on it ah uh, here we'll start it at i don't know wait a minute milk class is a little more pricey um 25 on that um it's a collar necklace milk glass fully pronged silver tone there's the back. And it does have a J-hook right there. Okay. Crystal. Yeah. Um, I don't think it's a real common name. My daughter's 34. She'll be 34. I'm pushing years onto her. I do have one more, more pearling here, and I do have a sterling box. I could go through that and pull some things out. I have a pair of faux, um, faux uh, star sapphire. All right, no, no interest in a milk class. I'll leave it there just for a minute. What did I start at? 25. I sold the one that had like the tie tape on it. These are signed 925, or they're signed Sterling, actually. Oh, okay. It must have got more common after that. They're signed Sterling, and then M has a capital M in the parentheses. And then A-A-A-R-R-I-O, -R -R which is something, in, it means something in Italy. Oh, should I get rid of this? <laughs> I guess. I didn't clean these. They could be cleaned and become much cleaner than this. I'm sorry. I did wipe them real quick. Okay. They are signed in the back sterling and have an M. I can't enlarge it, but I'll try to show you. Um, if I enlarge it, it'll knock me off. Sterling with a capital M in a parenthesis. And up here they say, I think it's A-R-R-I-O. Um, but they're diamond cut sterling earrings. Uh, hold on a second. I don't know. I don't even. Hmm. They're nice. They look filigree, like kind of, or sterling, Mark Sterling. Like I said, if a capital M in parentheses and A-R-R-I-O, I think it says up here. It's hard to read, but they're sterling silver. I think they're pretty. There's the back. I feel like I'm really close. It looks blurry to me. Okay, I've shown them long enough. Huh? These are a sterling bit of um, 20, if anybody's interested. They're nice. Sterling silver. I think they're a three inch drop. Um, let's see. Two and a half inches enamel. Yeah, let me let me try to get my, I, I see Patrick in. Um, let me try to improve my light crystal. They're not enameled. They are just like diamond cut filigree, sterling silver. They're not, they're not enameled. Does it look blurry? I'm, I'm sorry if it does. Let me wipe this off, okay? Just to make sure nothing's on it. I mean, it, it was a wild day, a wild night of me rolling around in pain. No, I'm joking. And the background might be interfering. But sterling silver, no enameling. Diamond cut filigree, that's what I'm going to call them because that's what they look like. They're nice. They're wires, sterling wires. Okay. All right, I'm gonna um, call them the Patrick. Let me make sure, because my eyes are bad, Crystal. So uh, to a degree, I mean, I, I would typically, they need cleaned. They are not, no, they are just diamond cut, like, uh, filigree. And they, these are made, these are from Italy. 
that's that's why they have the marking up here. Let me tell you exactly what it says since I can't show it. I'll try to read it. I don't know. I think it's A R R I O. There's some markings up here. Um, she's good. It's okay. It's okay. I don't, it's no problem. They could use a wipe done with a cloth. Whoever gets them, Patrick. I'm gonna call him the Patrick. Uh, five, four, three, two, one. Sold to uh, Patrick for twenty. Thank you, Patrick. They're nice. They're nice earrings. They do need cleaned up. Baking soda is great to clean your earrings with, and then a cloth or just a cloth, like a baking soda paste, and then wipe them with a cloth. I don't like dipping them. I think it makes them look like messy. You're welcome. Thank you. And Izzy, she's doing great. Um. Yeah, see, when, when Maury was in the hospital, um, she she was sick for a little while, and I didn't know what was going on. I didn't know if it's her arm or whatever, but she didn't feel good. Um, but I seemed to have, like, the same type of weird symptoms. The symptoms, not weird. I was head chills yesterday, last night. Or something got from the hospital. They're good at giving you things. Brass findings. Agate. Yeah, she's doing really good. She's just adorable. I, I, I want to hold her. I hope this passes quickly. Is that the April the 8th? I thought it was April the 8th. April the 6th is my oldest daughter's birthday. So 27 inches on the agate. I thought it was April the 8th on the eclipse. But there's banded agate on here. There's several different shapes and types on here. Thank you. Thank you, um, Crystal. Yeah, she's she's adorable. That picture, I snuck it. I snuck that picture, guys. I was real bad with that. She don't know it's on there because she don't go on YouTube. All right, I hope not. If she catches me, she might get mad. But I had to share it. It was too cute. All right, this is agate. I'll start this at 30. Um, it's nice. Breast breast beads separating. You have different shapes and types, colors, and like there's banded in here. Kind of looks like bullseye right there. It's nice. I see Patrick in uh, at uh, 30. Thank you. I'll just show it just for another minute. Um, Eva's doing good. She went back to her dad's last night. I had her an extra day. Well, not really. I had her later in the evening. I share custody with her. She's doing good. She was helpful. Helpful with the baby. She tried to help. All right. I'm going to call it to Patrick. $30 for the agate. Thank you. Congrats. Oh, 54321. So it's nice. I like agate. Um, you find it occasionally too. All right. Is there anything else anybody's looking for? Let's see. I, well, I've only been on there and a half. I'm not feeling yet. I think this is nice. This is Science Miracle, and I'm shaking all over the place. I'm sorry. You're welcome. Thank you, Patrick. It's Science Miracle under there. This is a pin. And there's a Celtic cross right there. See the glowy, like, cat's eye, kind of. There's a cross right there. Signed Miracle under there. Um... I have a really cute little teddy bear thing. Oh, I'll start this at 22. It's, I think it's nice. You have the glass cabochons. And across. I'm probably gonna, uh, I don't know what we're doing. Probably keep the kid home from, Eva home from school and maybe go somewhere to look at it. I don't know if I have her that week, actually. I have to look at that. Do I have her? Is that next Monday, guys? Yeah, I have her. She'll be back on Sunday. But um, it, the brand is Miracle, M-A-R-M-I-R-A-C-L-E. How dare you spell that wrong, right? Celtic cross in the center. And it's really pretty. These are glass cabochons. And they look like cat's eye, purple, glowy, kind of like moon glow. But it's actually glass. Okay, and then Alina um, is in at 22. Thank you. It's very pretty. I think it is. I like it. It's about an inch. Let me tell you how big it is. Well, it's an inch and a half, actually. 
All right, I'm going to call it to Elena for 22, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. So thank you. I thought it was nice. Purple, purple glass. Pin. I felt cold and I felt so hot. I probably need to go. Uh, oops, that's all I need. Um, <laughs> take the sweatshirt off, maybe. Yeah, it's. Um, Particularly when it's sick, guys. Terrible. It happens. People people get sick when they are stressed. You know how that is. Anyways, this is this is nice, I think. And I thought I wrote it down. Um oh my goodness. Did I not? I forget what it's called. It is called um National Museum of Artists N N G A National Gallery art of art or something like that a national gallery of art that's exactly right it's a cool it's a matte finish and it's a glass cabbage on it's red looks foil backed it's closed it's a signed n g a h r m and it's a national gallery of art that is correct i think it's nice um it measures two and a half inches this starts at 20 if anybody's interested Yeah, it probably wouldn't be anywhere near as exciting, Crystal, having an astronomer with you. But this is cool, I think. I can imagine. I've never seen one. I would like to. I would need to read the safety guidelines or whatever, though. <laughs> to make sure I wasn't doing anything, you, you also know you were safe with him because he knew what he was doing. Um, Is it dangerous? I don't even know. All right, I'm going to call it. It's nice. This is nice. I like that actually. I thought it was really nice. Uh, five, four, three, two, one. Sold to Crystal for twenty for the. Let me write your name down. I know I've sold to you, haven't I? I you're real familiar to me. Um, if I haven't, just email me right there. But I believe I have. Your your name's very familiar. So it's it's the sun. <laughs> yeah, how cool. It's nice. All right. Thank you, Crystal. Congrats. All right. Um, yeah, Maury's okay now. She was real tired the one night though, and I, I had to I had to take over. I had no choice on the matter. Um she was needed sleep. But it took it to warm me. I'm not Tell you what, it's a big difference doing that at 55 than uh, I did it at 40 and I at 42 and it wasn't anywhere near as tiring as it was now. I just could barely handle it. Look at this, guys. It's just a little uranium brooch. It's gold tone. Looks gilt with gold. I don't see a mark. Well, there is one here. No, there's no marking, but I think it's cool. It is uranium glass. Those are all pronged on there and I don't see a marking on it, but it's a rollover pin. What did you say? Oh, okay. Yeah, if you could email me. Just your YouTube name. Uh, so, you know, if it's, even if it isn't different, just to remind me. Uh, country in which you live and then your PayPal email address. You know, if you don't use PayPal, you could pay um as a guest. This is one in one in almost one and three quarters. No, she had a vaginal birth. She did fantastic. I never had one. All right. If anybody likes this, I'm just doing starting bits with everything I at 15. It's uranium. Um it's a little vintage birch. If you go to the skate park with your kids or whatever. You'll have a light up flower or your grandchildren. <laughs> I don't see him working on it. But she's doing okay. She's doing a lot better today. She's doing the steps. She's she's tired. She's taking care of the baby hundred percent. She needs to because I I don't I can't I don't have the milk. She does formula, but mainly milk. Till Maury's milk comes in more. Yeah. 
<laughs> it's okay. I knew what you meant, Amy. All right. So this is sold to Alina. I'm just gonna do buy it now. So I'm just gonna roll down from now on. Uh, but 54321 sold to Alina. I have another one. I have a little teddy bear, guys. Look how cute. I'll get it in a minute. That one's this is Alina, right? Yep, yep. All right, look how cute. Thank you, Alina. Isn't that adorable? It's glass. Hold on, it's a little teddy bear. You have different colored pink, clear. It's open in the back. See? These ones are foiled. The top ones and the bottom ones are clear. Yeah, it's all vintage. I only went to the estate guy and I dug through his vintage boxes and, and I bought some out of the counter too. Some of the necklaces came out of the counter. Most of the pins came out of boxes he had. But it's a cute little teddy bear pin. It's glass. It's gold tone and adorable. If anybody likes it, it starts at 15. I think it's super cute. Or I could have just did a buy it now on that, really. I mean, consistent. One and a quarter inch. Not deliberately. I think it's cool. Um, yeah, it's cute. Pink center, glass clear feet and they're all fully pronged and then you have the foil back on these and these all right i think it's cute i might hang it off the curtain if i don't sell it by the baby she's starting to like focus on things and try to look at things she's very adorable she makes those baby noises i'm gonna get on I don't hear her crying. That means she's sleeping. All right. Well, we'll pass on it. What else do I have? Is there anything I haven't shown that you wanted to see? I did pre-sell a portion of what I have. I do have a milk glass bracelet, the Napier set. These are, this is all vintage costume here. All of it. This is milk glass and clear rhinestones. A fold over glass bracelet. I didn't sell the other milk glass. I pre-sold the one. This is seven inches and it's vintage. Marquee uh, milk glass and rounds like square. And then you have the clear rhinestones in the center. There's the back. I'm gonna measure it. Did I, I already did, seven inches. <laughs> milk glass bracelet, let's see. It doesn't matter, does it? Uh, this will start at 15 if anybody's interested. Clear rhinestones, milk glass, seven inches. I'm, I'm once again buffering. Yeah, our little baby. I don't like not being able to hold her. It's not me. I shouldn't. I don't really do it at night. She rests. Well, you know, I'm really buffering. This is milk glass. Do you guys see that? She's pretty cute. All right, milk glass bracelet. I also have this one, which, uh, yeah, I sold most of what I had, actually. Here, um, we'll pass one out if anybody's interested. I'll, I'll bring it back. It'll probably be in Wednesday's video. Um, I may sell at the same price, you know what I mean? Uh, it's, it's worth a little more than that. Anyways, this is a mosaic. It's signed Italy in the back. It's a ring. If anybody's interested in this, it's 15 is the starting bid or the bite now, really. Yeah, she's so, she's so cute. Flowers, rings around different color. You have yellow, red, white. And it's about an inch, deliberately cut out. That is mosaic. I'm gonna see, I don't think it's micro. I think it's a little bit smaller. <clears throat> I'm buffering up a lot. I think it's a sign, and it's tired. Um, one, one and a quarter inches. I'll get out. I'll get out another day this week. I'll probably go see him, but I also have to go source and look on the wall. Um, I find good, great things at those other stores. That's where I got that amber I just had, the opal. My, I miss my other stores. It's just been hard for me to go anywhere. And this guy, I know I can go and get bulk, um, decent stuff. All right, that's mosaic. Blue trimming, uh, the pieces of tower blue around the edge. You have white and red and then you have yellow and red like the white and red is here 
it all seems to be there. It's a little, there's a pin. Yeah, she's cute. I had to leave the room. I felt so awful. Oh, time getting sick. All right, I'm going to pass on that. I think I'm done on this. I, I hate, well, it's only been there 40 minutes. How about, does anybody like this? I could sell this. This is Kirk's Folly. I had it here to sell if anybody's interested. I'll offer a couple more things and I'll go. I'll make it 10. I am a little tired of not going to make it on to three hours. I will, um, I'll invoice in the morning. Okay. Or I might do it tonight. I could do it from my phone at this point. All right. This is Kirk's Folly hair clip. You have rhinestones. Um, it's silver tone. Sign Kirk's Folly there. And what's that say? Kirk's Folly again. I don't know. He this this if anybody wants it, I'll do it as a buy it now thirty. It's nice. It does work actually. I had it put in my hair wrong the one day and it fell out. But back here you have some rhinestones, so it shows from the back, and you have clear rhinestones in here. I am starting to feel like I was cold at first, and I was starting to sweat, and I'm buffering really bad. You guys see that? I don't know why. Oh my god, don't tell me I don't have the internet on. I'm almost done at this point, but I may have forgot to put the internet on. And it doesn't work real well if you don't have the internet. It's a Kirk's Folly hair coat. Alright. Oh, okay. I'm going to end it with that. I sold a portion of my stock pre-sale. I, I did that. I, I haven't been doing it a whole lot when I get bigger things. I did save a couple of things like the pearls and stuff. Um, I saved them because I was trying to research it. Yeah, I need I need that. That's what my daughter always tells me. Um, the nurse, she does emergency. I need some tangerines. I'm going to get a glass of orange juice. Yeah, I like it. Yeah, it could work for bridal, though. I think so, yeah. Or if you just want a, something pretty in your hair to help keep it, you know, in place. Yeah, you guys going to see Anna's going to have normal colored hair soon. I'm going to a brown, like, I think I may do um, ash blonde because that's more of, like, what my natural color was, a dark blonde, light brown. And I think it'll mix well with my, I have gray that's salt and pepper kind of like. It's going to be silver. My gray is going to be silver. So... I'm going to go for it. I'm going to get rid of the purple. I'm tired of people like the kids. They say they know it's my hair. They'll be like, it's purple. I'll be like, okay. Okay, it's, it's mine. <laughs> nice to be. It's great. Okay, Aileen is in for 30. Thank you. But yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get rid of the purple hair. I want it to be able to grow out um, more naturally and be able to grow my gray out if I feel like it, but just have highlights going with it. You know, like a dark blonde to add it to it. We'll see. I have to call. I have to call him. It's sad because I went and saw the one girl who's not the owner. And the owner did me when she was on maternity leave. And now I want the owner to do it. Because she did my hair better. It stayed in longer. Anyways, you guys really don't give a shit about that probably. There I go with a whole story on. This is some South. This is for Alina at 30. 54321. So Alina. It's nice. I have worn it a few times. And I like stuff in my hair. Yeah, yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready for a normal color of hair, guys. I do have some Nolan Miller. I, I do have more costume over here. I'm getting hot, though. Um, <laughs> let me show Nolan Miller, because these are the good, nice ones, actually. I have a nice pair of Monet. I can put them in Wednesday's video. All of this can go in Wednesday's video. Um, I got it decently priced. So these, these though, these are nice Nolan Miller. They are signed Nolan Miller in the back. Let me see exactly what they say. Just Nolan Miller, the copy. <laughs> yeah, I want to go more natural that way as it's grown out and have highlights mixed with it. It's not as shocking when it comes out. Because right now it's hard. These are Nolan Miller. I think these, I'm not sure the exact dating on them. Those are sapphire colored rhinestones and clear in a faux pearl, mall base style set. But they're pierced. And these. Let me see. I don't know why I didn't write that down. I don't know. 
They start at 30 if anybody's interested. They're nice, Nolan Miller. You do care. There, you can show. <laughs> they took it away. Okay, there we go. My, I have like an inch of gray or not, guys. Maybe more on the top of my head. It's pretty. I let it go deliberately so I can see what it looks like. And it looks, it's a lot of gray. Okay. Nolan Miller signed in the back. They're signed back here. Pear Stearings. They have Nolan Miller. These are the original clips. I mean, original backings are signed Nolan Miller as well. I don't know. Your platinum. Yeah, I I um I can see mine now. It's a nice color. It looks silver. I mean, it's not like a grayish. It's not white. It's silver actually. But so I'm gonna see what she could do with it to make it look um natural. And I want to let it grow out. You know, somewhat. Okay, we'll pass on this. <laughs> So, you know, guys, I do have the Wednesday video. Um, check it out if you haven't. I, I'll i have new stuff. And I'm going to go shopping tomorrow probably. Um, Maury's doing pretty well. I think I could go out for like an hour or two. She's taking care of the baby 100% herself. But I want to help her make food and stuff. You know, make sure she's being fed um, so she doesn't get sick. You know, if she's too tired to get up the steps. That's what I've been doing. But, um, oh, look, this is uranium too. The middle, the end ones are uranium. And there's one red stone there, okay? And I don't know why. I think it's a cool little pin. Here, this is a buy it now if anybody wants it of 12. <laughs> yeah, I'm tired of keep keeping, having to worry about getting the burgundy colored hair. It's too hard. I don't want to waste the money on it. I stopped paying for the fake nails. They're not great, but they're mine, you know. Um, I only did that for a short period of time. It felt like a big waste. So there's that. And then I have this. This is Napier. And it is enamel in the background. So, you know, it was all painted. And then they stuck that on there. This is Napier. I actually have um, a pair of earrings that go with it. Clips. You cut it down two inches. I don't think I could pull off that. I don't think I could pull off a, a bald head, guys. <laughs> what I'd look like. Um, I still think I don't know if I have the face. So I've kind of, I don't know. Maybe I could do it. I have thought about it and then wearing wigs. I'm not going to lie. You know what I mean? Okay, so this is Napier. But I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, to, that'll be in Wednesday's video. I'm tired of working. We'll talk for a minute. I'm, I just want to talk for a minute then go. Thank you for coming here. I will probably invoice uh, tomorrow morning, tonight, if I'm laying in bed and I can't sleep. Who's got the crazy white temples? Oh, <laughs> I have gray, um, mainly on the top on me, but on the sides too. And I found like a two inch, like a hair this long grown on my face. Okay. And I was like, I don't know why it's hiding sexy. Oh, because when I was harassed that day, I blocked that because somebody was coming and talking about kids saying filthy things, disgusting human being. But anyways, um, I mean that too. I won't take that back. Vincent Price, <laughs> he's out here. Um, I get gray. They're like grandpa. It makes me think of grandpa from, uh, what is it, the Adams family. It has all that gray. Like poofing, people are like, "What the hell is she talking about?" This is a jewelry. So I'm done. I'm winding down now. I will have a video out on Wednesday. I'll put some of what's here. I'll try to go through the silver box and put what's laying around. It's been here a long time that I can afford to sell really cheap. I'll do that, and I'll put the costume in for less. I have a lot. It's building, but I, I am done selling. I I did I did enough. I did pre-sales. I'm satisfied with that. I'm tired. Grandma Munster, yeah, <laughs> Grandma Munster. <laughs> They are. Yeah.
Yeah, that was pretty bad. I will get a good night's sleep. I hope. I'm going to be done off Mari. Um, I might go out into the living room. She really isn't needing me. Um, I help her in case she gets exhausted. And, you know, little baby's been doing real well, though. She eats, she goes to sleep. She eats, she goes back into her little bassinet bed on the side. Um, <clears throat> It's right in the room. Maury's in my room with me. She does have a room here, but she's in my room for now. All right, guys, I am going to go. Thank you for being here. Um, I really appreciate it coming and keeping me company and uh, not getting upset with me <laughs> for leaving early. I, I'm a little tired. I, I need to rest. I It's important. And I also need to shop. I think I'm going to wait until 2 p.m. and go down and ski in the fall. Um, yeah. Yeah, I feel a lot better today, but it was wicked. I had the chills. I, I was hot, sweaty. It, I had to go out in the living room because I couldn't open the window when I would get hot because the baby was in the bedroom. All right, guys, thank you so much. Well, yeah, she will be moving out soon. Uh, in a few months, we're waiting. We're getting the apartment, um, getting it, uh, you know, ready, getting it, we're going to furnish it and everything like that beforehand. I'm going to help her somewhat. Um, but, yeah, she will eventually. Look, everybody's going. She's like, stun jewelry, so nobody cares. Okay. <laughs> All right, guys, I'm sorry. Let me get off here. I am going to go to bed early tonight. Um, I'm going to get on. I'll probably write up what I sold, and I will probably go <clears throat> lay on the couch and invoice, because why not? Thank you for being here, guys. Yeah, I'm going to take two more. Love you guys. Thank you for being here. Bye.